talk about the Gophers? Yeah. Uh, and I said it outside. The, the coaches do a good job every week of setting something out different. Um, this week was no different. Had an opportunity in the first half of a similar play. Harry's service is consistent. Always there. It's always good. Um, luckily, I got a second chance. Did the uh, miss in the first half sort of help you figure out how Philly was going to move on the play? And sort of then uh, when it happened again, you could just sort of concentrate on, on getting it right? No, nothing changed. The difference was the ball uh, in the first half. I think Connor gets a little bit of a piece of it, throws me off. Second half, it was a clear header, so it was the same play. The uh, play at the end was healthy call. Did you get a good look at it? I was behind Gonzalo. I, I've seen it again. Um, so. As frustrating as the result may be, it's hard to lead. I mean, to hold the lead when you miss some opportunities at the top as well. Yeah, no, the, the Frank said it at halftime. He said, you know, when we get the lead, it was 0-0. Zero, zero. He said, when we get the lead, you have to finish the game out. Um, unfortunately, we leave it in the ref's hand. We don't finish the game. We don't get the second goal. We don't push to win the game. You have to go and win the game. You have to win the game at home. You have to get the second goal. Um, unfortunately, calls are always kind of lurking in the shadows. You never know when they're going to pop up. If you, if, if you give the ref the, the opportunity, the other team the opportunity to, to get a point out of the game, it can get you, and it did tonight. Do you feel like you guys sat back any in the second half after getting that goal, or do you think the chances just weren't falling for you? The chances were there. Tactically, they change a little bit. They throw more guys forward. It's you know it's the same story. They begin to, to serve the ball in the box. We dealt with it pretty well. Um, you can't just run up the field and, and allow numbers to to accumulate. You know and and think that the defense is going to deal with everybody. You have to sit back. You have to mark everybody up. So tactically, it changed. We still had opportunities to get a second goal, and we didn't. Uh, result aside, do you find that the defense is sort of gelling more the way you want to? Uh, clean sheet last game and yeah, no, they they've done well. They've done really well tonight. Guys in the middle did really well handling. Connor is a big guy. Um, they didn't have much down the left side. A few crosses on the right, but really not much. Um, they've done a good job. It's unfortunate that you know in the 90th minute that we we lose the the lead in the game. What was the plan for Connor Casey tonight? Because he's been sort of on a roll over the last couple of games. Um, you know, he, he, it doesn't change what he does. He's very good at what he does. He holds the ball up. He's good in the air. Um, and they run off of him. They have, they have players underneath him that he can drop the ball off to, and, and they get the ball wide. That's, that's uh, what he does. So we knew what was happening going in. But like I said, John Abaki did a good job on him.